Good day, class. You are welcome to Lagos State e-learning program. I am Afolabi Ademola Oladapo. I teach mathematics. The topic we want to treat today is equation of a straight line using different forms, lesson objectives. By the end of the lesson, students will be able to determine the equation of a straight line. One, using gradient intercept form. Two, using gradient and one point form. Three, using gradient and two point form. What we are treating now is forms of equation of a straight line. In a previous lesson on gradient intercept form, equation of a straight line is given as y is equal to mx plus c, where m is the gradient and c is the intercept. In this lesson, we look at the same equation of a straight line in some other forms. We now look at equation of a straight line when the two intercepts which the line makes with both x-axis and y-axis are given. Consider the figure below. Area of triangle ABO is equal to area of triangle PBC plus area of trapezium APCO. Hence, half Y bracket open A minus s bracket closed plus half x bracket open b plus y bracket closed is equal to half a b which is equal to y bracket open a minus x bracket closed plus x Bracket open B plus Y bracket closed is equal to AB by multiplying through by 2. By expansion and the simplification, we have AY plus BX is equal to AB. Therefore, divide through by AB we have x over a plus y over b is equal to 1. The required equation of a straight line in intercept form when x and y intercepts are given. Example, write down the equation of a straight line making the intercepts 3 and 2 on x and y axis respectively. Solution. A is equal to 3. B is equal to 2. x over A plus y over B is equal to 1. By substituting 3 for A and 2 for B, we now have X over 3 plus Y over 2 is equal to 1. Multiplying both sides of the equation by the LCM, which is 6, we have X over 3 times 6 plus Y over 2 times 6 is equal to 1 times 6. 
That is 2x plus 3y is equal to 6. Y is equal to minus 2x all over 3 plus 6 all over 3. Therefore, y is equal to minus 2x over 3 plus 2. That is the required equation. See you after timeout. Bye for now. Welcome back, class. Now we will be learning about the gradient and one point form. This form is obtained if we are given the gradient M and one point on the line, and we are required to determine the equation of the straight line. Let's consider the following diagram on the Cartesian plane. From the graph above, gradient of x, y is equal to a q all over p q is equal to y minus y1 all over x minus x1 is equal to m. Multiplying both sides of the equation by x minus x1, we have y minus y1 is equal to m into bracket x minus x1. By substituting for x1, y1, and m, we get the required equation. Example. Find the equation of the straight lines with the following points and gradients. 1. Gradient 3. Passing through the point 1, 4. 2. Gradient minus 3. Passing through the point 3, comma, minus 5. Solution. 1. Y minus Y1 is equal to M into brackets X minus X1. X1 is 1. Y1 is equal to 4. And M is equal to 3. Therefore, y minus 4 is equal to 3 into brackets x minus 1. y minus 4 is equal to 3x minus 3 by expansion of the brackets. Therefore, y is equal to 3x minus 3 plus 4. Therefore, y is equal to 3x plus 1. This is the required equation. Number 2. x1 is equal to 3. y1 is equal to minus 5. And m is equal to minus 3. Therefore, y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1. Now, y minus into bracket minus 5 is equal to minus 3 into bracket x minus 3. Y plus 3 is equal to minus 3x plus 9 by expansion of the brackets. Therefore, Y is equal to minus 3x plus 9 minus 5. Therefore, Y is equal to minus 3x plus 4. This is the required equation of the straight line. See you after this time out. Bye for now, class. Welcome back, class. We will now look at two points gradient form of equation of a straight line. The equation can be formed 
using two given points on the line. Let the points P, X1, Y1, and Q, S2, Y2, be any two given points on the line X, Y. And A, X, Y, be a variable point on the same line as we have in the following figure. Then, gradient of PA is equal to Y minus Y1 all over X minus X1. Let that one be Roman figure 1. Also, gradient of PQ is equal to Y2 minus Y1 all over S2 minus S1. Let that one be Roman figure 2. The two gradients 1 and 2 are equal since the slope of any straight line is constant. Again, the slope of any straight line is constant. Therefore, we have y minus y1 all over x minus x1 is equal to y2 minus y1 all over s2 minus x1. This is the required equation of the line with coordinates s1, y1 and s2, y2 as any two points on the straight line. Example. Find the equation of the straight line which passes through the following pair of points. Five comma two and three comma one solution. Five, two and three, one stand for S one Y one and S two Y two respectively. S one is five, Y one is two. X2 is 3, Y2 is 1. Substituting the values in the formula, Y minus Y1 all over S minus S1 is equal to Y2 minus Y1 all over S2 minus S1, we have Y minus 2 all over X minus 5 is equal to 1 minus 2 all over 3 minus 5. So y minus 2 all over s minus 5 is equal to minus 1 all over 2. That is, y minus 2 all over s minus 5 is equal to 1 over 2. Multiply both sides of the equation by the LCM 2 into brackets x minus 5. We have 2 into brackets y minus 2 is equal to x minus 5. 2y minus 4 is equal to x minus 5. That is 2y minus 4 is equal to x minus 5 plus 4. Therefore, 2y is equal to minus, is equal to x minus 1 by adding 4 to both sides of the equation. Therefore, y is equal to x over 2 minus half. This is the required equation of the straight line given two points. Here are some past questions for your practice. Number one, YEC 2015, objective questions 15 and 16. Number two, YAC 2016, theory question number 13. Three, YAC 2017, theory question number seven. Have a blessed time.